Melissa Wiggin, Starlight Escalade, and High Point Novice Horse Non Pro Level 3. Congratulations. Thank you. Um, how was this horse different showing today than she was in the first round? He was a lot more with me. <laughs> I've had a struggle this whole week. Um, we had a great year last year and uh, we've been fixing a lot, but today he was. I was in control, so that was good. We still have a lot to do, a lot to work on, but we're getting there. That's a plus. Um, how do you feel like you brought him to this point that he could, that he was with you today? Lots of practice, and I guess touching on the basis of uh, the things that I have let kind of go in the show arena. Um, I went for world titles last year, and it was t it's tough coming back from that. So kind of making it correct and kind of working on the finesse. Uh, can you walk us through today's run with him? Uh, yeah, we trotted in. He was with me in that. He doesn't like this arena, so sometimes he's not with me in that. The circles, um, left circles were great. He came back really well, which the first day he didn't come back as good. Um, turns were good, no penalties there. It had been in the penalty box earlier this week. Um, other circles were great, changed leads. He was there with me. Need to work on our stops a little bit more, just kind of finessing those and getting down the pin. But um, not one of our, not one of our best scores today. But I think that we're definitely making some ground, so that's good. Did your trainer give you any special advice before you went in today? Well, finally today he told me to have fun. <laughs> and my trainer is my husband, so I told him I'm like all week I've been struggling, and you have not told me to have fun. <laughs> I guess that's the game plan that works, huh? Yeah, I needed to hear that. Yeah. Um, so where do you guys plan to show next? I think we're going to go to Denver. Um, I'm not quite sure what Rascal will do. If he'll go to Denver, if he'll school. I have a lot, like I said, a lot to work on the show pen. It's not just Rascal, it's me. But um, maybe run for a million, but I don't I don't know if I'll take him. Maybe let's just take my daughter to show her horse. Nothing's real concrete this year. Last year was a hard run, so I don't know what, what comes and what we can get. I think it's a blessing, so yeah. Um, you guys have anything else going on here at the Derby this week? So I think I'm going to show on Sunday and then my daughter Kendall shows uh, in the youth um, and my husband will show tomorrow on the novice horse. Other than that, no. And who do you want to thank for helping you get here today? So obviously Travis and my girls and family, friends and basketball. Mark Ellis had the privilege of being affiliated with the National Reining Horse Association for over 20 plus years. Uh, and fortunately or unfortunately, I've been representing Mark Hell for uh, almost all those years as well. We um, are a very integral part of the horse industry. We intend to remain an integral part of the horse industry. When you look at organizations like the NRHA and NRCHA and other organizations that we have had the good fortune of representing, it's um, about what we can do for the people through the products that we have to offer. That being not only livestock mortality, but uh, commercial equine insurance, farm and ranch coverage, and also commercial liability and professional trainers liability. Uh, are they applicable to all? No, but that there are so very many people in the industry um, that can use what we have to offer. And I'm very fortunate to have a team of specialists that work with me for Markel, uh, our, our Western Discipline team, and uh, they offer products through for people, Western horse people in particular, throughout the country. Uh, we have some other opportunities that are becoming available now um, with the hopeful addition of uh, a new organization and some new entities along with some other products that Markel offers as a corporation. Their winery coverage, their camp and uh, path coverage that we've been involved with for years. And uh, I look forward to the next 20 years representing Markel.